Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this now is my problem. Solution from here. From what we have, which is 5 raised to power 11 minus 3 squared. Then, here yeah, we can rewrite 5 raised to power 11 as 5 raised to power 10 plus 1. This is 3 raised to power 11, then minus 3 squared, that's 3 times 3, and that's 9. And from here, when we apply the law of indices, a raised to power m plus n, this is same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. That is, here we have 5 raised to power 10 times 5 raised to power 1, then minus 9 from here. And also here, minus 9 can be written as minus 5 minus 4. That is, here we have this as 5 raised to power 10 times 5 raised to power 1 is still 5. Then minus 5 minus 4. Here. Then when we group this together we have 5 common and we factor it out so we have 5 into bracket 5 raised to power 10 then minus 1 here minus 4 from here the next step we can rewrite 10 here as 5 times 2 and this becomes 5 into bracket here we have 5 raised to power 5 then raised to power 2 minus 1 here can be written as 1 square then close bracket minus 4 from here then here what we have follows from difference of 2 square that this one we have a square minus b squared which can be written as a plus b multiplied by a minus b at this following this here we have 5 into bracket 5 raised to power 5 plus 1 then close bracket also open bracket 5 raised to power 5 minus 1 close bracket then minus 4 that is here we can substitute 5 raised to power 5 here which is same thing as 5 times 5 times 5 times 5 times 5 which is 3125 that is here we have 5 multiplied by 3125 plus 1 then also into bracket 3125 minus 1 then minus 4 that is from here this is 5 into bracket 3126 then into bracket 3124 then minus 4 from here then from what we have we can rewrite this as 5 into bracket 3100 plus 26 here then also into bracket 3100 plus 24 close bracket then minus 4 from here that is also here we can separate 100 from here and say this is 5 into bracket 31 times 100 plus 26 then into bracket also 31 times 100 plus 24 close bracket the minus 4 from here that is we can use a letter to represent 100 so let m be equals to 100 that is from what we have here this can now be written as 5 into bracket 31 m plus 26 
then also into bracket 31 m plus 24 close bracket the minus 4 then from what we have now we can open this two brackets then 31 m multiply first so we have 5 into bracket 31 m test 31 m here yeah? that becomes 961 m square then plus 31 m multiplied by 24 from here we have 744 m then plus 26 times 31 m that gives us 806 m then 26 times 24 we have plus 624 then close bracket minus 4 from there and from here we have like times here let's bring it together so here we have 5 into bracket 961 m square then plus 744 m plus 8 Four and six M that give us one thousand five hundred and fifty M then plus six twenty four close bracket minus four and from what we have here five we open this bracket five times nine sixty one M square we have four thousand eight hundred and five M square then plus 5 times 1550m we have 7750m then plus 5 times 624 we have 3120 then we have minus 4 that is from what we have now we can recall that m is represented at 100 then substituting back here we have 4805 times 100 square then plus 7750 times 100 then plus here when we subtract 4 this remains 3116 that is from here what we have here become 4 eight zero five zero 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 then plus also we have seven seven five zero then zero zero from here plus three one one six then we can sum this together from here then from what we have this becomes four Let's bring it under each other. That's four eight zero five zero 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 zero. Then we also have zero zero zero. Then five seven seven. Then we have six one one three. So the sum of this here. Then here we have six. Then one one. We have eight here. This sum to 12, that's 2, we take 1 over, because this, that's 8, then 8 here, then 4. So here we have the final answer to this given problem as 48,828,116. So here we have the solution to this given problem without the use of calculator. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn the notification bell on and share this video. Also, put your comment in the comment section. And uh, thank you for watching. See you next class and bye for now.